All right, so this new show, Discretion, what, it's so discreet, the details right now. <laughs> what, what can you tell us about this show? It is, um, look, it's looking at a married couple who've been married for a long time who are at this point in their lives where they're confronting their issues uh, with their relationship and life and self-discovery, uh, um, wanting something more in life totally separately, and, uh, and they're doing it in very unconventional ways. Okay, and I hear that you take over the persona of a male gigolo that your wife has maybe done some things with? Yes. What kind of research goes into becoming a male gigolo? <laughs> um, uh, a few I, screenings I, of Magic Mike, maybe? Well, <laughs> a little. You know, I was invited to that one, so, oh, okay. you know. <laughs> um, I, I, had, I didn't exactly visit strip clubs or anything, but... No, look, I, I just assume what it would be like. And really, it's, it's uh, his journey, uh, that's part of his journey into that world, is not so much a, um, an active, purposeful journey. He's free-falling. So he's, he's kind of tumbled into that, as, as Grace has sort of tumbled into that world as well. But it's almost they're trying, they're actually looking for something good. You know, they, they both feel disconnected from who they are at the core, which is very easy when you're married and you're working and you're a parent. And so they're, they're longing for something good. And in this longing, they go through unconventional, not necessarily good roads. But hopefully it's for a better transformation in the end. And can we know a couple of these roads that we might travel down? Um, I think part of part of what I loved about this story is is this this couple is living in the modern world with all its trappings, I guess, you know, uh, almost self-made prisons of work. And Neil's a workaholic. Uh, Grace is sort of dissatisfied with where she's ended up in life. She's had and to sacrifice a lot, like many women. You know, she gave up a scholarship, she gave up a career to be a mother, which, which she loves being a mother, but all of a sudden there's this emptiness. And like you said, that's why it's so modern, because nowadays we, we want it all. We just, we just don't want the, the surface success. We want to feel fulfilled inside. And the, the critical, it, it, instead of actually dealing with that along the way, they're reaching a critical point, and they just have to smash it. So, and it's the smashing, which is fun to watch. Yeah. Okay, so we're talking all about television today. What are your guilty pleasure t TV shows to watch? Uh, I don't know about Guilty, but <laughs> Game of Thrones, oh, obviously yeah. just started again. Huge fan. Masters of Sex. Good one. Good, good one. Sherlock. Oh my God, Sherlock. Yeah. Sherlock. You gotta watch it. <laughs> yeah. All right, well thank you for being with us today. Where can fans catch the show? On the USA Network. This summer, right? This summer. Yes, yes, this summer. All right, thank you so much. Thank Thanks. you. Thanks.